IGP confirms sack DSSDG, Dow is still in detention, reveals location contrary to news that circulated on Thursday that the SAC Director General of the Department of State Services DSS, Lawil Dawra has been released, latest information has confirmed that he is still in the custody of the Nigeria police. The Inspector General of Police, Ibrahim Idris, made this known in a report on Tuesday's siege at the National Assembly. The findings on the probe into the DSS action was contained in a memo Idris addressed to the acting president Yemi Osun Baho. The IGP said Daura was still in custody and that he was awaiting presidential order on the next line of action. He wrote, there is need to search the houses and premises of all identified suspects. All communication gadgets such as computers, mobile phones and other electronics devices of the suspects will be thoroughly analyzed. Conclusion, it is crystal clear that the principal suspect Lawal Musa Dawara may be acting the script of some highly placed politicians to achieve selfish political goals, hence, his unilateral and unlawful decision to invade the National Assembly complex. As it stands, the principal suspect, Mr. Lawal Musa Dawara is undergoing further interrogation at our facility and is currently placed on house arrest at a private property in Burnan Kebi Close, off Burnan Kebi Crescent, Garki 2, Abuja, awaiting further directions from Your Excellency. The presidency has since appointed Matthew Sayefa, the most senior director in the agency. Meanwhile, the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, on Thursday afternoon arrested a former DSSDG, Eterek Penyong. He was reportedly arrested in connection with alleged N17 billion fraud in the agency. The arrest was said to be part of ongoing probe of the SAC DG, Dowera. It was gathered that two ex-DSS chiefs could not account for the cash in the last three years. Yesterday, operatives raided Ek Penyong's house located in Asakoro, Abuja.